Good morning. Today we're in Antioch, Illinois, visiting the air duct cleaning training facility at Meyer Machine Supply and Equipment. As we take a walk through their retail shop, we'll get to see many of the items that they have to support the air duct cleaning industry. And as we step into the air duct cleaning training facility, we'll get to see the extensive ductwork that they have hung for training. Today we're going to demonstrate how a strong vacuum collector can collapse ductwork if dampers are closed or if too many openings are covered. So we'll start the vacuum. This is the Electrac 1 it runs off of 115 volts and it has a variable frequency drive. It can be started on as low as a half an amp and it can be run up to 20 amps or whatever the amp load of the circuit allows. Today we're going to run at 15 amps. As we increase the amperage, airflow through the vacuum increases. We see a weak point in the duct right here that has already started to bow. Currently we have all dampers open and we're going to start closing them. As we close the dampers, internal pressure on the duct increases. causes further collapsing of the ductwork. This shows the principle of negative pressure and why it is so important when you're doing a duct cleaning to close the registers as necessary but to leave enough open for makeup air so that ducks do not collapse. Thank you for the time today.